it's Larry Stewart with FourConstructionPros.com. We're here at ConExpo ConAg talking with James Crouch, who's the uh, farm uh, tire segment manager for, for Michelin. And farm tires, because the skid steer tires, backhoe tires, they all come out of the, the, the ag group. Mm -hmm. And the, the big news today, uh, James, is that, that uh, Michelin's got a new tire out for uh, obviously telehandlers, we got one right here, and you tell us uh, about applications and what kind of tire we're talking about. Uh, the tire we're introducing is the Michelin Power CL. Uh, it'll be targeted toward compact telehandlers as well as backhoes and any other kind of construction equipment that uses the sizes that we're bringing in. Uh, it'll be available in July if everything goes as planned. And it is the first and only buy supply tire in our, uh, in our portfolio. Um, this tire is offered everywhere in the world except for the U.S. right now, the U.S. and Canada. Oh, it's already, Michelin's already producing it globally. Yes. This tire has okay. been available in every zone except the North American zone for years now. And, okay. Uh, is it the only bias ply tire globally? It is the only bias ply Michelin tire globally. So tell us why bias ply tires. Well, I mean, Michelin, first of all, we should set this up. Michelin is, a, is essentially an, a radial exclusive company, a, a company that, is, that has built its reputation on radial tires and the, the radial story. And I know that story well, and I'm sure most of our, our listeners do too. But uh, so why, is, what's, why a bias supply tire? With the construction tire market, we, we, have, we have several radial offers. We have a new offer coming this fall, the Biblode Hard Surface. We have the XMCL, which is a radial backo tire, so mm -hmm. the same sizes that we have here with Power CL. Uh, but we've realized now that the market is still very much a biased market. It's very slow to radialize, unlike ag or unlike even earth mover in some cases. Mm. So we want to be able to give our dealers and our end users a tire to fit every situation. So that's why we have the bias ply offer now and two premium radial offers. Okay. And um, how we, uh, will the bias ply tire perform differently from, a, from the radial in these applications? It still performs very well on uh, the, all of the cases that we have globally. It performs very well. You don't get quite the ride quality and quite the wear performance that you do in a, that you would expect from a radial tire. Mm -hmm. So you still have all the Michelin benefits, the high loader carrying capacity, the nice ride, but you just don't have quite the capabilities as far as ride comfort and tread life as you do with our radial options. So um, uh, it's it, it you do have sizes for skid steers, right? Uh, yes, they are all radial. So that that's a bib steel. Hard oh, okay, okay. okay. The, different, this bias tire line. is not a skid steer tire. No, then. no, okay, it's back okay. back hotel a handler. Back hotel a handler. Yeah. All right, all right. Um, and. Um, how does the does the the Michelin bias ply? How did how, how did Michelin come to market with a with a bias ply tire? When you compare it to other bias ply tires out there, what kind of differences will people notice on, in the Michelin tire? Very very high load carrying capacity and the the ride comfort that you'd expect out of a Michelin. So really? th this was our, our OE demand brought these tires into existence, okay. and uh, we've actually agreed to bring them into North American zone with the with the uh, co. Uh, with cooperation from Caterpillar in the UK, they're okay. going to start, start importing some backhoes on these tires. So we'll have both OEM replacement support in, the, in North America. Okay, all right. And when you say that the ride quality is, mm. is good on these, and we, you know, we all know, I mean, we've talked about how the, the radial is really a ride quality mm -hmm. um, uh, kind of tire. What, what about the construction of this tire is going to improve the, the ride quality in a bias? It's just the, the way the, the way the tire is constructed, the way the casing is constructed. The, the rubber compounds in it are different to, to make that rod quality better and make them more resistant to chips and uh, cuts. Uh, it's also steel belted for added uh, added load capacity. Okay. All right.